Hello. It's not quite on okay. view. There we go. Hello. Hello. Is that someone here again? Da, da, so what are we going to do? So we're going to look through this and then open them. Uh, Sorry. <laughs> yeah, them. Just point off screen. Them. Or do we want to uh, open those up and then read and look as we do it? Even though you've I really think... spoilt it by looking at it. No, I was doing the pictures for the thumbnail. Hope you like the thumbnail. Um, I think we should look at the front cover and see what, what it is. We, we should read Man. the front. <laughs> and then see what this year's book is. And I... then I think look at what's inside when we open the cards. So we've got woman who likes to play with green things. Mm hmm um, we've got a man who's trying to kill fly. There's a fly. It's yeah. a very basic fly. It's like a Minecraft fly. Ah. There's a, is that a scarecrow man? Ah. That's There's a man with too much steroids. Yeah. There's a bike lady. Ah. With a carrot coming out her head. No, she's throwing a spear. Oh, I thought that was a, a carrot. A cow spear. Oh, okay. Yeah. Pretzel. Breadstick? A wiener. Oh, is that a wiener? Okay. Yeah, it's a hot dog. Is that an apple? And a banana? If that's an apple, something weird has gone on. It must be genetically modified. Well, she's got a green one and he's got a blue, a red one. Mm. A blue one. Right. This year's theme. Living amazingly. Okay. I can't remember what the previous years were. History was last year. It was not a classical history or something. Yeah. Well, no, no, no. Generic. It wasn't, no. Last year it was like... Great people, or like something like that, or like scientific breakthroughs, or something. Mm. Collect, learn, play, and create. This worries me. Brand new design. So what? Does that mean the pictures are different? Because I kind of expect that, or does it mean that there's some more complicated way of putting them in? Because that was pretty complicated. Before. There is but one way to find out. Plus 60 pages of healthy facts. Plus loads of games. Oh, it's paper. I thought that when I was just photographing them. Because as well, you can sort of see through the paper. So what are we doing? So uh, Shall I read? Because you opened. Card 4. Is that card 4? Zero, zero, 004. I don't yeah, know. I don't know. Pro Surfer. The surf is his turf. And Pro Surfer is riding the waves of success. Waterway to make... A living, oh, it's meant to be a joke. Waterway to make a living, huh? Gnarly. Mm. Nineteen. And a poor symbol. Is this Baseball like a rock, field. paper, scissors game? Oh, possibly. I guess we'll find out. I think we read through no, this pack and then we'll have a look inside. The baseball fielder can catch anything. Balls, fish, trains, cold, you name it. He's caught it. What a pro. I think that's a bit insensitive right now. I get a feeling that in one of the previous incarnations of this series, that joke's been used before. Yeah, me too. That rings a bell. Not so new designs, hey? Uh, number 66. Kentai Warrior. Nobody messes with the Kentai Warrior except for the neighbour's tiny dog. That is, the cheeky... Chihuahua chases him down the street every morning. Do you know what the Japanese have done? What? They've created a 20 metre Gundam. It moves in everything. You might have to explain that. You know, giant robots? Yeah. A 20 metre giant robot that moves. Oh. I, I, I just, I couldn't believe it. It's like only in Japan would they do that. Oh, shiny. Shiny. Sea rescuer. Only last week, the brave sea rescuer saddled two seahorses, helped a crab across the road sideways, and even taught a school of fish. What a heroine, eh? Is she wearing makeup whilst being on? Yes, because these are Lego figures, and how else would you know it's a girl? It's got boobs. Uh, you can does see it? it, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Well, boobs. yeah, but maybe it's a man who's on prostate right. medication. Okay, so. As this goes on, I think we'll put them in as we go more because we won't. So the first one's number six, yeah? Double them up. Uh, four. Number four. Numero cuatro. Okay. 
Wow, dude, these spuds sound awesome. Right, so you need to read the bit about spuds. A uh, hob. Oh, is it that one? That bit goes with three. Maybe that one, wouldn't it? Yeah. Harvest begins in summer. Well, it depends what you're harvesting. Mm, true. Growing potatoes is an exciting business. No, really, potatoes are a very easy going kind of vegetable. Oh, I've got a potato bite. <laughs> uh, they'll, <laughs> they'll grow happily in just about any well drained soil. Um, then come August in the UK. Oh, sorry. When come. Sorry, my brain is dead today. Then come August. The UK is. Crisis crossed. Chris, Chris crossed. Ah! <laughs> Potato crisis! See, the problem is I'm actually reading this at a 90 yeah. degree angle. My head's here. Criss crossed by both huge combine harvesters and humble problem. wheelbarrows, all working tirelessly to unearth the nation's right. favourite root veggie. Over 31 kilograms of potatoes are munched by every Brit annually. That's 600 grams a week. I'm all sleepy now. Do we go to bed? Yeah. That's it. End of video. <laughs> Night-night all. Now I'll try and read the next one. Oh, properly honest. <laughs> yeah, let me move position. All right, what's the next one? Uh, next card is nineteen. Nineteen. Okay, there you go. Oh, the light's reflecting off that so bad. Do you want me to read it or you? No, can... I'll read it. Okay. Well, you gonna put them in? Which one is it? This one. Oh, okay. Baseball fielder. So if I'm putting it in, I'm going to be in your way. Well, he's supposed to say. I can't see your hands in the way. I can even softly catch a butterfly with this mitt, I swear. See, look, I can read. The, the light's reflecting now. There you go. Um, are we going to go for fatty facts? Yeah. Although healthy, sunflower seeds contain a lot of fat. And while it's true that fat is very important for helping our bodies absorb vitamins, it should be consumed cautiously. Fruits and veg have little or no fat, while oils, nuts and certain cuts of meat contain lots of it. The best fats to eat are unsaturated fats. You'll find, for example, in fish, soy or walnuts. Fats help the body take on vitamins, keep skin healthy, and build up vital parts of our bodies. Yeah. Lily and Sam are zipping through the tunnel into mainland Europe on the train. In France, they can only marvel at the flower fields and discover why they're so colourful. I have no idea what you're reading. That bit there. No. Oh, okay. So, next card. 66. Okay, so it's maybe there's on maybe the onions will scare the dog away too. Oh, they actually so these actually do kind of. I suppose it's better because it. they've actually put the little arrows on to show you which corners to put in. There we go. Right. Do you want to read this or shall I? Am I doing? It's in the blood. Yep. It's in the blood. Blood is essentially what keeps us alive. With every heartbeat, blood rushes through us, transporting oxygen and nutrients to all parts of the body to make our cells work. Blood also fights infections to help you get well quickly. It's made up of plasma, as well as red and white blood cells. If you want to help your body increase its circulation of blood, reach for some onions. You might need lots of them to make it work, but your blood will be running just fine. No one's ever going to want to kiss you, though. No. Because, you know, onions. 60. 63. Oh, it's on the same page. Look at that. I know. It's also before that one. Oh. You failed. Well, I was going through them in the way they came out the packet. No, you weren't. You know, I asked you for the first one. Hmm. Apparently they're a choking hazard. Welcome to the desert. The continent of Australia is many things. Death world is a good one. Um, but above all else, it's huge. It's the world's sixth largest country and the driest inhabited place on earth. No wonder Australia is home to ten deserts, each one bigger, dry and hotter than the last. The largest of them, of them all is the Great Victoria Desert. It's bigger than the UK. 
Although it's insanely hot and dry, it's teeming with life. Lots of animals feel quite at home there. Where is the, including that kangaroo? Yeah, where is the driest place on the planet? Oh, oh, I know this one, the Antarctic. Well done. There's no rainfall in the Antarctic. Your turn. Are we opening the second packet? Today? I think we'll open another four, and then that's it for another this video. Another four. Yeah. We're already at ten minutes. Well, it's the start of the beginning one, so. I hope you've all got a cup of tea. Or a beer. <laughs> Uh, this will go live at 12 o'clock in the afternoon. Exactly. You should be on your second beer by then. Okay. Because, you know, the government have made it clear that you need to drink faster, harder, and finish sooner. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, chocolate box. A piece of chocolate every now and then won't hurt as long as you eat some fruit and veg. I guess feeling this is aimed for children. I don't like this now. Oh. Yeah. Build a juicy orange and green carrot. Really? Build a juicy orange and green carrot with your bricks. To balance out your chocolate. Because they've made a chocolate box, so you need to make a carrot. Oh. Do you want to put this one in? Yeah, might as well. What number? 109. Um, no, no, no. Yeah, cool. Do you want to read the brain teaser? Brain teaser! Find the cocoa fruits. Cocoa fruits have been scattered all around these two pages. Can you find them all? Add the two ones right here above. Find the solution on page 56. Mm. I don't think we're going to do that, are we? Is it did you know facts about chocolate if you want? Oh, did you know, Is that for this one? Because we... I don't know. Okay. Do you want me to do that? Did you know chocolate origins? Chocolate or chocol? Ha! Huh? Sound amazing and strange. Oh, cho I haven't read that right, have I? How the hell am I to say that? There's like an X at the beginning. Chocolate or chocola ha? Sound amazing and strange. Actually, this is a source from which the word chocolate is derived, but it tastes nothing like the stuff many people love so much. This mixture of water and cocoa powder tastes like very bitter. The ancient Aztecs and Mayans were known enthusiasts of the drink. As Europeans had a hard time pronouncing the word, they came up with the easier but wrong pronunciation, chocolate. The rest is history. I think we also first fermented it. And that's how mm. we get the actual cocoa. Mm. Next. 71. Shall I read it? Why yeah. can find it? Okay. Athlete. For the athlete, everything is a competition. She even challenges her two legs to be faster than each other, which explains why she runs in circles. Trouble. Mm. They got stones and stuff. Mm. However, that's double edged, re retouched. Look. It's not as good as the one you found, is it? No. Possibly older than the one you found. Mm -hmm. These are just normal scatters, though, aren't they? I mean, I'm not convinced by that one at all. Or that one. That one's that not one's convinced real. as tools, but convinced as evidence of tool making is what I'd say. Yeah. Find me an ostrich. I want a proper race. Mm. Australopithecus. How do you say that one? I can't It's one of the oldest extinct. Australopithecus. Is one it's of Lucy. our oldest extinct ancestors. Yeah, but Lucy's a lot easier to pronounce than Australopithecus. Australopithecus. Some of that, yeah. Oh. Are you reading that one? Oh, no, no. I want to guess. I want to guess. Is that cheveux? There's a picture Ancient cave paintings show how our ancestors hunted. I don't think it actually says it. Like I think that might be France. That. <laughs> Uh, whoever runs fastest or endeavour... I'm doing it again. I'm reading at an angle. My brain it won't work. Endures longest wins. Uh, that was the case even back when our ancestors started walking upright. They didn't run races, of course. They ran to hunt down animals. With spears or stones. They also ran to survive um, the attack of an ill-tempered saber-toothed... Saber-toothed tiger, yeah? Which doesn't exist as an animal. Save a dwarf tiger! Um, uh, 
Was it Smilodon? That's what actually it's called. An ill-tempered Smilodon. Okay. And that was even more. Uh, and that was more even more important than getting a medal at the finish line. Well, yeah, because yeah, not having death. Yeah. Has some negative side effects. I've heard. One three one is the next card. I like this page. I'll read it later on. Okay. Wow. Station barista. Need a coffee in a hurry? The station barista will have yours ready quicker. Ow! Is that what it says? No, I just, my arm hurts where the corner of the book stabbed me. The oh. station barista will have yours ready quicker than a bullet train, and no delays guaranteed. You, you okay? Come on, put it in here. You got like. Come on. Come on. Well. Gosh. Oh, gosh. Right, so which one do we read? Um, we go down to this tree. Listen closely, plants can communicate with each other. Yeah, and they scream when they're killed. Mm -hmm. So, you know. Hey tree, talk to me. Did you know that plants can communicate? It's not like they can talk to you unless you're a flower pot girl. Plants use chemical reactions to communicate with other plants. The mimosa tree is a perfect example. If this tree gets attacked by a swarm of angry insects, it starts to release an odor-free gas. Other mimosa trees around react to the gas immediately. They concentrate tanning agents in their leaves to make them unedibly un bitter. Disgusting insects. No, disgusting. disgusting. Happy yeah. yeah. My coffee's only bitter if that's how you like it. Yeah. Ooh. Numero un. Not number one. Sam. Sam's challenge is to taste every food under the sun just to find his favourite. There's got to be more to food than mustard and ketchup. Sam. Hobbies. Mental exercise. Cooking with Lily. Eating his favourite dishes. Why would he eat the plate? Is the food not good enough? I was going to say the same thing. <laughs> um, playing memory games. Favourite ingredients, cream cheese, potatoes and chilli peppers. That would be oh, horrible plate. to get. No, actually, no. actually, I think my dad had hummus, which was kind of like chilies and everything. Mm. Um, Favourite cuisine, Thai and Italian. Role model, Stephen Hawking's and all hard-working chefs. Yeah. Not Gordon Ramsay then. He doesn't say bad language chef. No. So that is the first four of uh, 2020 Lego album. Da, 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 da. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.